let's face it ai has taken over 90 percent of transcription jobs and the remaining 10 percent they pay peanuts what if i told you there is a transcription platform that actually pays 120 dollars for every hour of audio transcribed the company is called ecolabs and today i'm going to show you step by step how to open an ecolabs account and make 120 dollars transcribing one hour of audio it is that high paying but first what is ecolabs ecolabs is basically a transcription company but unlike other transcription companies, it mainly focuses on providing captioning services to higher learning institutions, mostly Ivy League universities in the United States of America. Given its clients are mostly Ivy League universities, that's why they're able to pay a lot. When you go to the platform, there is a basic transcription that has already been done for you by artificial intelligence. What you have to do is just format it such that it follows the guidelines you're given by Ecolabs. Why do you need a US account? You need a US account because it pays highly and it has lots of works. If you open an account that is not a US Ecolabs account, you'll get paid anywhere between 10 to $20. But if you open an Ecolab US account, you get paid $120. That is 10 times the normal pay. Before you open a US Ecolabs account, you basically need two things. You need an anti-detect browser. In this case, you're going to use Mulogin and you need a proxy. In this case, you're going to use Nordmarven. So the first thing is just go to Mulogin. Link is in the description below. Sign up to Mulogin. Once you've signed up to Mulogin, download the version that is for your particular system. You can download either the Windows or the Mac version. Once you've downloaded and installed it, I also want you to come here and subscribe to Mologin. It only costs $5 a month and you get to run 10 profiles. All these tutorials that I'm going to go through, they're all going to be using Mologin. If you make a $5 subscription, have 10 profiles, that's going to be more than enough to jumpstart your Make Money Online gig. Once you've, subs you've downloaded your Mologin, you've subscribed $5 a month, then you're going to go to Nodmarven. Nodmarven is going to be your proxy providers. There are many, many proxy providers. The reason I love Nodmarven is they have a filter and you only get high quality IP addresses. What you're going to do, again, use the link in the description. You'll get a 35% discount once you make the purchase. What you're just going to do is sign up. In my case, I've already signed up, so I'm just going to log in. Log in. I'm taken to my dashboard. First thing I'm going to do, I'm just going to open my more login. Open my more login. See? I already have one profile here, the outlier profile. If you want to learn how to open an outlier US account and earn as much as $8,000 a month, check out that video. It's in our homepage. In this case, I'm adding another profile. Easy. Select advanced create. In this case, the profile I'm creating is, I'm just going to name it Ecolabs US. Again, it will automatically select the operating system for you. Just stick with that. If you're using Windows, it will select Windows. If you're using macOS, it will select macOS. Go all the way down here where it's saying proxy. I'm going to select SOC 5. And I'm going to go back to my Node Marvin. Click on proxy setup. So go on proxy setup. I am going to select the country as United States. Then there's a neat trick I like using to make sure I get mobile IP addresses from Nodmarvin. Mobile IP addresses are high quality. The good thing is on Nodmarvin, both mobile IP addresses and residential IP addresses are the same, same price. So this is what I'm going to do. ISP, I'm going to select Verizon Wireless. Perfect. Then I'm going to select SOC 5. And what I'm going to do, take this. This is our username. Input it here. This is our password. Input it here. Then our host. Just input it here. And the port. Input it here. If you want to get mobile IP addresses from Nodmarvin, you have three options. Here, where it's written ISP, you can either select Verizon Wireless. You can select T-Mobile. That one, or, or you can select AT&T Wireless. Any of this will give your mobile IP addresses more reputable. You won't get banned. Your account won't get closed. Now that we're here, we've set up everything. I'm just going to confirm that my proxy is functioning normally by testing it. And we expect a green light. Yes, it's in California, Cupertino, and it's working perfectly. What I'm going to do is just click confirm. Once I've hit confirm, I have my new profile here run the profile after running the profile here it will show you that this is your ip addresses your location 
just before doing anything, I like visiting the website pagesoutscan.com. This website will tell you whether your fingerprint is okay, whether your IP address is okay, and whether everything is perfect and you're now ready to start opening the account. Yup, it's telling me everything is perfect. The fingerprint is consistent. The Chrome version is up to date. IP is fantastic. And as you can see from here, it's a cellular IP addresses, meaning it belongs to a phone and you won't get banned. Now, straight to Ecolabs. To sign up to Ecolabs, you need a very, very specific link. If you try and sign up using the normal link, ecolabs.ai.signup, you'll realize that it takes you to the client version. So if for you to for you to sign up using this version, you need an email address that ends with dot aid. Sign up is a different link. You need to go to hotol.al.ai slash sign up. Don't worry, the link to this I've included in, in the description below. Then you just visit that particular link. What happens is you visit you you're now taken to the transcriber's version of the website where you can input any email and you can set your password. So in this case, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to use the same Gmail that I used before. This is the email I'm going to use. Copy that email, paste that particular email. Then I'm just going to set my password, confirm the password. Then I create an account and save the password. Immediately after creating the account, I will receive a link to verify the account. I'm going to do, I'm just going to copy the link, paste the link. To verify the account straight away i'm taken to a place where i need to do the exam and the exam is broken down to three different sections the section one which is given a four hour limit but they are really really snazzy disguise if you want to be able to pass the exam without being timed out you need to do it fast like within two hours or so you have section one section two section three so you need to time yourself so that you complete each of these sections of the exam within two hours the most important thing when it comes to being able to pass this exam is you need to read the style guide thoroughly here's a style guide you have a style guide here just open it in a new tab it is basically a word document that goes ahead and lists all the different specific ways that they want you to style these transcripts and captions. It's a whole thing that goes into what's captioning, what's transcriptioning, it define the terms, how you're going to write down math equations, how you're going to write down common names, how you're going to separate out the different speakers from one another, the maximum number of lines captions can occupy, and such and such. What I want you to do is in order to set yourself up to pass this particular exam, is to just read this thoroughly. Just go over it, maybe for a whole entire day. Just going over it, take notes that you're going to refer to later when you're answering this particular exam. Once you've read through the manual thoroughly, severally, until you're well familiarized with it, then I've also included links to various Google Docs below that just give you a feel of the sample exam, the first exam, the second exam, the third exam, what they're going to be all about. It's surprisingly a very, very short exam. This is, for example, test one. This is test two. And here is your test three over here. What I just want you to do is go through them so that you're familiar with potentially what the test could be about. Then once you're done with that, I just want you to come and bite the bullet. Start doing the exam. And you can just click here to start the exam. Remember, once you start, no pausing. But the good thing with this is that you can try it several times on multiple accounts. In fact, I would advise you to mentally put yourself in their frame that I'm going to do this four times. I probably it won't open the first time, the second time, but by the fourth time, you'll have at least one Ecolab account. This is how basically the workspace works. You listen to the whole audio. As you listen to the whole audio, you are going to be just transcribing using this particular tool. All right, once you're done with the first exam, the second exam, the third exam, you will wait for a few days, one, two days, and the results will be out. Once the result will be out, you, when you log in, to the dashboard you will see something like this various various tasks a number of tasks you can pick any of them and start doing them the pay varies you can have a task that pays 120 dollars per hour of transcription you can have another that pays 30 hours per hour of transcription 50 hours per hour of transcription the important thing is to do your best to ensure your quality is the same you maintain a very very high bar of quality and you'll keep receiving orders you'll get paid out and that is how we're going to be rich online if you're not into transcription and you still want a high paying online job, then check out our playlist US and UK work for non-residents. Don't forget to subscribe.